Hi, Alex Forte here, the Art of Simple Golf with Alistair Davis. Now, we've got an interesting sort of drill for you to do today. Now, what is this about, Alistair? Because we have a table. They're not going to have a table on the range, probably, but what are we trying to demonstrate here? They shouldn't have a table on the range, they should they? Not unless you're eating lunch. Well, you can take it, I suppose. We're looking really at creating the correct feels in the downswing or pre-impact positions to deliver the golf club in the most dynamic fashion we can at impact to create the best contact, the most power, the most consistency of club face delivery, basically. And, and the reason why we got here is because we were talking about the swing is watching me hit a few shots and I was sort of, I would say, dumping it a bit early and I was losing lag and kind of that compression. So, and I was struggling to sort of get that feel and he just brought me over to the table. And I said, we've got to shoot a video on this because it is great, but it is a bit of a challenge, isn't it? This is kind of some tough love uh, training you know, especially if we can hit balls, whether you can do it in your yard with plastic balls or, or into a net or something, it really is very good. I think, yeah, it creates the ultimate positions, really. It probably overkills the kind of shaft lean, the trail elbow positions in the downswing that the elite players get. And that's amateur golfers, and I'll call myself an amateur golfer in that respect, so I'm not a tour player. It's the positions we, you know, are really jealous of and try and create ourselves. They're difficult to feel because it's in swing, it's in downswing. The golf ball's there. Yeah, it's not a position, it's a motion, isn't it? Yeah, the golf ball on the ground creates us all wanting to try and lift the ball off the ground. So we all try and dump that club a little bit early, generally yeah. speaking. So what we're doing is, as you were talking about the shaft lean that we want into impact, about getting it there, but also getting that compression that we want with the rotation, right? But it's not about that position, it's about a movement. And this drill where you're placing the club on there puts you in that position b before impact and forces you to really get down to that ball to get that shaft lean and to get the ball first, right? Okay. I think the keys of it is when you're in the position, I'll just demonstrate practicing okay. and you're going to have a go at the shot. You're going to embarrass I'm going to embarrass myself. All right. I'm, I'll stand over here. If we have the golf club in this position, obviously the shorter you are, the more lean this will create or the more lag this will create, if you like, the more wrist cock this will create at this position. What I want you to get from this video really in this drill is how we would initiate that club to the ball is we have to use our body to drag that club forward. Yeah. I can't do anything with the hands pushing down to get the club off. To sort of hit it down here or something or cast it out. So we have to feel that the rotation in the body is accelerating and then the hands are much more passive. So we maintain that kind of elbow position that goes down in front of our body and therefore then we get that shaft lean and the club is working down into the ground much later. So it's sort of gathering, that's the sensation, is that's what I felt anyway. Yeah. But it is a bit scary to do it and now I'm going to do it on camera. You are indeed. All right, here it goes. So, uh, yeah, so we're going to try and put the ball hopefully where I've gauged where I'm going to be able to make a decent contact so we're just taking a normal setup position and putting the club here and I'm, oh, what I was finding very important is to try and feel sort of that kind of I'm not bouncing the club but to feel sort of relatively agile so then I can come into the ball all right here goes so there there I am okay it's pretty tough it's tough all right so what did I do there what's the feedback that I realized maybe I had the ball in slightly wrong position, a bit too far away. But what I'm trying to, going to try and do again. Rest on there now, come on, move your body. Turn, turn, turn. Very good. Okay, so I got the contact there, just about. But you see, the first one, I know what I did. I was perhaps so concentrating on using the hands to the ball that I just sort of stopped and dumped it. But the second one, as you said, I need to rotate all the way through. So that's the key, but you can practice it at home, as we were talking about, if you're not gonna take divots on the range or wherever, but even at home with the club flipped around, just getting that sensation to keep rotating through. Yeah, I think the key f for me is you have to use your body more. Now, how we retain the wrist angles in, in the golf swing better is by rotating. And if we slow down the rotation too early in our body, the hand speed increases too early, and then we get that dumping sensation. Well, yeah, and so it's like really raw, tough love feedback from that drill especially so but at least uh the, so you got the idea but we're going to show you another drill that doesn't involve a table and hopefully not as embarrassing if you want to get 
help with every facet of your game, just click the link below and go to theartofsimplegolf.com slash free for a really great series for the ultimate lessons, ultimate simple lessons to help you play your best golf. Now, please like and subscribe, share the channel. If you have any questions whatsoever about this video or others, just leave them below and we always get back in touch. Thanks for joining us. Thank mm -hmm. you.